Bad Farmer by Ben Goldacre Narrated by Jot Davis Intro Medicine is broken, and I genuinely believe that if patients and the public ever fully understand what has been done to them, what doctors, academics and regulators have permitted, they will be angry. On this, only you can judge. We like to imagine that medicine is based on evidence and the results of fair tests. In reality, those tests are often profoundly flawed. We like to imagine that doctors are familiar with the research literature, when in reality, much of it is hidden from them by drug companies. We like to imagine that doctors are well-educated, when in reality, much of their education is funded by industry. We like to imagine that regulators only let effective drugs onto the market, when in reality, they approve hopeless drugs with data on side effects casually withheld from doctors and patients. I'm going to tell you how medicine works, just over the page, in one paragraph that will seem so absurd, so ludicrously appalling, that when you read it, you'll probably assume I'm exaggerating. We're going to see that the whole edifice of medicine is broken, because the evidence we use to make decisions is hopelessly and systematically distorted, and this is no small thing. Because, in medicine, doctors and patients use abstract data to make decisions in the very real world of flesh and blood. If those decisions are misguided, they can result in death and suffering and pain. This isn't a simple story of cartoonish evil, and there will be no conspiracy theories. Drug companies are not withholding the secret to curing cancer, nor are they killing us all with vaccines. Those kinds of stories have, at best, a poetic truth. We all know, intuitively, from the fragments we've picked up, that something is wrong in medicine. But most of us, doctors included, don't know exactly what. These problems have been protected from public scrutiny because they're too complex to capture in a soundbite, or even 3,000 words. This is why they've gone unfixed by politicians, at least to some extent, but it's also why you're listening to a book of over 400 pages. The people you should have been able to trust to fix these problems have failed you. And because you have to understand a problem properly in order to fix it yourself, this book contains all that you need to know. So, to be clear, this whole book is about meticulously defending every assertion in the paragraph that follows. Drugs are tested by the people who manufacture them in poorly designed trials on hopelessly small numbers of weird, unrepresentative patients and analysed using techniques which are flawed by design in such a way that they exaggerate. Sample complete. Ready to continue?